Howdy everybody, Big Fatty Plus, and welcome back to the Big Man Plays. Planescape Torment, requested by Bormac. When last left off, we had killed Ravel. Or Ravel. She went mad after we tried to leave, because she had a hard-on for a nameless one here. So, yeah, we couldn't have that, so, um... Okay, we have some more things we can get here. Yes, we can get... Can I... Nope, damn it. We need item not identified. Here. Then shoot. Because I... Can't double up, okay. Also, um Yes. Damn it, no. Wait, was it I had a weapon that was unidentified. Or something that was unidentified that I couldn't do anything with. Oh. Here, hold that for a second there, would you? It said that she had a natural ability to identify shit because she was a uh, uh really? I thought you had the natural I ability to identify things. Ignis, can you identify, please? No, you can't. Damn it. I gotta identify it. I can't use it to identify it. I was lied to. Let's see, is there another one? Yes, let's, uh... How many more seeds do I got left? I can get, ooh, I can get several of them. Yes, want to make some more of these, the uh, branches. I'm going to keep one seed. Just in case. And now my inventory is full. Of course it is. Here, you, you have that. You hold that. Uh, Jacan, you hold that, my friend. Uh, let's see here. So, magic item, slap it up, dee ba doo. Uh, bronze sphere, here. You hold that. Because that was your daddy's. I got a ton of crap here. Alright. Let's go ahead and. Examine the archway. Set to the arch. Leave. And now we have to go through the northeast. Oh, why'd you click save, game? We have to go through the northeast, I hope. I'm out. I'm out. Just run. Just run. Would you... For the love of the gods! Just... Fucking run! Seriously? God dang. Over here, now. Don't need to waste any more. Yeah, everyone else is already halfway there, man. Okay, now here's the part. We can't go through it normally. We said we have to fold arms like a cage and then leap. Then, uh, uh oh, oh, Ravel, and who the fuck is you? Off with you, dead I am. Then death's kingdom has sealed its gates to us both. Arise, crone. Shh, shh, shh. Away with you. I'm dead, and no traffic with I care little for how you die, but I warn you for the last time. Arise, or I shall slay you where you lie. Okay, who the hell is this guy? I had thought that dying at his hand would fulfill the requirements the past before. You cannot have thought that one would have a chance. You were indulgent to let him think he was successful. Oh, this incarnation is. And kill me he could have, but for a few tricks I possess. 
fortune Fox abandoned you the moment I found you? Has your life prepared you for what is to come, Hag? Not of the likes of you, ragged thing. Weak Ravel may be, but a few tricks has Ravel learned over the years. Uh, and I no. have known that you would come to me. Oh! Cease, 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 cease. Yeah, you're taking a lot of damage, Ravel. Um, he just pulled off Elise's tears. Um, 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 um. Okay, she's, okay, she's, oh, that's a lot of damage. She's casting Black Star Hazel. Okay, and then, okay, you set her on fire. And then you're doing fire, right? No longer shall you trouble existence with your presence, witch. Okay! Damn, I don't know who the hell you is, but... Damn! And... Okay, now I'm in... Cursed. Hey, how you doing, buddy? You see one of the curses fights? He looks a little poor. What do you want? Don't you know it's a lockdown? Um, but what can you tell me about this place? We're under lockdown right now because of the plague. Don't know what's causing it, but we're quarantining sections of the town until we find out. You want something else? A few more questions. What do you want now? I'd like to see the person in charge. What is the, the burger? He's in the administration building. Good luck get to him though. You don't see anyone these days. This might definitely go in someplace else. Um, looking for a diva? Then you're looking at the wrong end of the Great Ring, Burke. Cause even if there were one, you'd be you not be finding it. Talked away in them like a miser's gold. Yeah, forget it, you bastard. And what the living hills of Trecha? Cursed is a prison town filled with betrayers and words and deeds. We must take care and watch each other. Oh, we have a Lim Lim. Hey Lim Lim, how you doing? Okay, I still have my pet Lim Lim. I didn't turn that thing to stone. Nothing, no way, I ain't stupid. Okay, so, um... So, uh... Yeah, apparently the place is... Oh, hey ma'am. Done. Hey, ma'am. This person turns you scowling as you interrupt him. Do I know you? That's right, I didn't think so. Now leave me alone. Farewell. Now fuck you too then, you big titty bitch. You watch your back here, okay? This place is filled with backstabbers. Yeah, I get the feeling everyone in here is gonna be... Um... Entirely unfriendly to me. Uh, this guy's glowing. Hey, a dump caretaker. What you doing, man? See a scruffy old man who reeks of garbage. He seems to know more. F in some yeah, he seems somehow more vital than most of the people in this of this town. More vibrant, as if he didn't quite belong here. He looks up to you with, as you approach and straightens his back. I come to see guys. Heard stories of wisdom and righteousness, examples to be set and lived by him. Who are you? I am Kais, caretaker of the town's refuse. I tend to the garbage, and in metaphor, I have seen a fair number of souls float this way as well. I am the voice that urges them to goodness, and I fear they ignore me. Okay. What is this place? This is the town's refuse. I watch over it to hunt the vermin who pick through it. I keep it from spilling into the city, and in turn, they bring me more. Sounds like a thankless job. Just like mine. What can you tell me of curse? Here's a town that is on the brink of disaster. All manner of evil is being done here, and nothing is as it seems. All is hidden beneath a veneer of civility, but the venom scars those who breathe it in. It's a poisonous town. Filled with the poisonous people. Tell him about this dump. He leans forward conspiratorially. 
There's a secret entrance into the underground here. A secret place almost no one knows. There is a way into the Undercity, he bosses. But I have never used it. Should I go down, I foresee I could never return. The way down is slippery and the rubble would collapse behind me. When I am ready to die, I shall slide down there and let the monsters feast on my bones. I updated my journal. See. Yes, he has a hidden spot in here. But I'm not going to take it because apparently the walkthroughs tell me there is a better way to go in. Uh, into the Winter City where I need to go. That gives me a ton more experience. Also, I should really check to see if anyone leveled up. Nope, better check my spellbook too. See if I gained any ability to uh, put more spells in. So I'll go ahead and move it and use Black Spirit. Sounds better. Guess we keep them. I want to use that! I'm staying mage for the rest of the damn game so I can use that damn spell. All right. I don't like the fact that it keeps making that noise like I'm about to get attacked. Okay, you look a little, um... Okay, um... Dressed middle aged woman. She has a scowl on her face and appears to be looking for someone or something. Greetings! She stops to stare at you from up forehand, saying, Who are you and what do you want of me? Um, I don't remember my name. She looks at you with mild surprise. Really? Are you by chance a petitioner? I understand they often lose their memories, but what's a petitioner? We already know. She pauses to think for a moment. Petitioners are those who have died and had their bodies reform on the plane. It most closely reflects their beliefs in life. They usually have no knowledge of their previous existence. Beth, perhaps this is the case with you. Huh? She's got a point. Possibly this rebirth. How many times could this happen? Well, I am not an expert in these affairs, but it is my understanding that it happens but once. Upon death, the spirit then returns to the, place, the plane itself. Unless, of course, you have traveled to another plane. If that is the case, then upon death you obtain oblivion. Uh, see, in any case, I have no name to give you. Show off you her hand. Good day to you, Cutter. I am Roberta. King and bowing little mad lady. Roberta! Yeah. Gotta be... Gotta be a gentleman here. <laughs> I believe you had some questions for me? Uh, yes. I'm at your service. Please ask him. Uh, ask him. I'm looking for a diva. been told he's incursed. She paused to think. I have heard that rumor as well. Unfortunately, I am unable to help you. I do not know the whereabouts of such a creature. You should inquire at the administrator's office in the town square, of course. You seem upset. Is there something amiss? She frowns. Yes, my husband. Carl Parfidor. It's not where he told me he would be. This is not the first time that he has lied to me about his whereabouts, and I am beginning to think that he... She pauses for a moment. I begin to think that he is with another woman, a harlot. Why would you think that? She sighs. He is quite a ladies' man before we wed, especially among that type of woman. And I've heard rumors. She looks angry. If I find the rumors to be true, I have a surprise for him. A surprise? Yes. She lifts her skirt, exposing her inner thigh. You see a sheathed dagger strapped to her leg. She draws the blade and gives you a wicked smile. I think finding this protruding from his back would constitute a surprise. Do you not agree? She puts the blade away. So you intend to Updated kill him. Updated my journal. She smiles. Her smile slowly fades as she considers her words. Finally, she sighs and sheathes her blade. I would if I could, but no. I am being a fool. Carl and I are no longer intimate. I would never get close enough to deliver such a blow. She looks away from moment. Only one of his women could. Okay. Oh, who's in charge here? Torvis Gilchev. He can be found in the administration office in the town square. What can you tell me about him? Torvis is a rather intense individual. She pauses to think. I know little about him other than the fact that he is a 
gift this eye. And the wizard. Okay. Okay, she's gonna kill her husband. Because he's cheating. I'm sure several people are cheering about that, which. Lovely. Uh, okay, let's. let's do some more exploration here. Figure out what else Curse has to stab me in the back with. All right. I don't know why he's like the, the, the walk through says, oh, it's a lovely town because she plans to murder her husband. Well, you know, dude, this happens in real freaking life. So what the hell is this building? Trader's Gate Tavern. Okay, the blacksmith. We're gonna... Thugs. The overpowering smell of slowly moldering foodstuffs marks this some sort of food storage tower. Uh, let's, let's go ahead and find the... Let's go ahead and check out the blacksmith here. The, the clanging and pounding from inside the building leads you to believe that it's a smithy. I'm pretty sure that could be the only thing. Could be sure. Could be just two robots having sex. This ain't a fucking smithy. This is this is a home. How was this a smithy, sir? You say it's a smithy. This is a house. This is a home. Okay, okay. There's a couch. There's a table. There's a stove. There's a bed. There's a dresser. And then there's a uh, thingy right there. Uh, it's a chest. Um. Um. Crumple Punch, how you doing, buddy? Listen, uh, this ain't a smithy. This is a house. Where's your smithy? I want to see your smithy. I want to see where. I want to see what you, what, what you're making. This ain't a smithy. This is a house. I, I want to have this. I want to speak with the artist here. This sour-looking burling man glares at you as you interrupt his work. He seems a little slow, but earnest. Not as poised as the others in this town. Hey, what you want? Uh, who are you? I'm Crumple Punch Malaco, the town smith. You want something? I think I'd rather call you Malaco than Crumple Punch. I'd like to see a look at your wares. So uh, let's see, what do we have here? Let's see, is there anything I can sell? Get rid of. Keep that hammer. Just in case. Don't know if I'll need a pry bar again. Don't know. No, I definitely won't need the stiletto ever again. Okay, let's see here. We got, oh, he's got bolts, so I could have bought bolts for, uh, Nordrum. Let's see, magical punch daggers. Uh, she's still got better. Siphon knuckles. Nah, ooh, I could have done those. Let's see, assassin knuckles. Ooh, what's this? 80, 50, 4,000. Good. One to ten piercing! Well, that, I should have saved some money. That would have been a good purchase. I would have handed them her straight away. Phantom Dagger. What's this? 1 to 6 piercing plus 3. Uh, this whole volition of this dagger seems to reach out as enemy sting to find the most vulnerable spot on any creature. That could be very good for me. Fiend Femur. Not used well by mages or lawful or good creatures. Okay, it's a club. Basically, someone's leg. Let's see, what am I carrying right now? Two to seven piercing. Okay, mine is better. My knife is better. Have you heard about a diva and cursed? A war? A diva? I ain't not one of them angel things. No, we ain't got one here. He pauses. You want something, mate? Um. Well, he's got some decent wares. Too bad that, um... Yeah. I don't need any of them. Except that fit... That's the one that's like 54 grand. I wish I had the money right now. I wish, I wish, I wish, I wish. I buy that for Anna immediately! Seriously, that is... That is a good fit. Uh, let's go visit the tavern. No, wait, no. Well, not the tavern. 
Let's see, let's go up here, visit the I'm green going. silo. Or not. Now let's go to the tavern. Tavern sounds like it'll be a little more fun anyway. Uh, Alright, so let's see. We got the tavern here. Oh, we got a lot of surly people here. Very surly. Surly people. Um, hmm. Very surly people. Uh. Okay, where's the. Where, where's, where's the. Yeah, a lot of different interesting people here. A lot of different interesting people. I'm supposed to be one I'm supposed to see sitting alone. Uh, hey, Marquez! I see a burly blonde man wearing the armor of a harmonium officer. His face is rosy with drink, and behind his smile, his eyes are filled with bitterness. He launches into a speech without preamble. I sent you! No! And stop wasting my time! He turns back to his whiskey and said fastly towards you. Oh, fuck you then, bitch. I'm Asshole son of a bitch. I say greetings, you say. <laughs> okay, you two just saying right. I really wish it would stop with that, those quick noises. It's like, I'm gonna be attacked! Also, I see a booty. <laughs> see a haggard. Grim man. His coarse face is lined and weathered, and his eyes are red trimmed. He straightens as he sees you. Hey, welcome to the Trader's Tavern. I'm tainted boss. The innkeeper. Yeah, what? What's wrong? Uh, what's wrong is my daughter got herself kidnapped by slavers, and now the place is going to fall behind on its bills, and I'm going to lose the place to no one, to one of those rich pikers in the first circle. Your daughter got kidnapped, and your first priority is to protect your barn. Family values, sir. He looks at you more closely. You're the fellow asking about the Deva, ain't you? Tell you what, you help me out, I help you out. Yep, what do you know about the Deva? Smiles craftily. You're looking for him, ain't you? I can tell you that he's hidden far beneath the prison. I can tell you how to get there, too, apart from being arrested or trying to bribe your way in. Which wouldn't work anyway. What do I have to do for this? We already know we can sneak in, but this is getting experience and possibly money. Go over there and talk to Marquez. He's the ex-Harmonium fellow. He knows about these slavers, and he holds the first part of the key that'll put you on the path to see in the, of seeing the Deva. There are five parts of the key, but it ain't a physical key. When you got the parts together, you, you come tell me, and it unlocks knowledge in my mind. Till then, though, it stays secret. You gotta satisfy the key holders. This place is with this place and puzzle key, seriously. Fine, I'll do it. My kids will tell you what you have to do, and when you're finished, you'll see your next person who has a key. Farewell. Updated you my journal. Son of a bitch. All right, bye down here. Okay, Ingus, I need you to look extra intimidating for this guy. <laughs> you're back. Swallows his drink. Ah, sent you? Good. Here's the deal. Slavers that kidnapped his daughter. It's your job to get them back. Your job to get them back? Or her back? Typo. I'll tell you where to find him. You go kill him, and report back to me. I'll help you find a demon in health. Maybe even teach you weapons. Greed? I have a few questions about this first. A few questions? No, oh, only two boss answers. Are you for slavery or against it? Um, I'm, I'm, I'm against slavery. Then you'll help, right? Yes or no? I help. Last I heard, the slavers are to the east of the inner cursed. They've got the nod from the city guard. Find them, make sure Barstar's alright, and kill them. When you're done, come back here and I'll tell you the first part of the key. You need to find a diva. Damn, I ain't been in the place more than five minutes. No red knows I'm looking for a damn angel. Shit! 
Doesn't stay secret and curse. Fine. Answer some questions about this for me. Updated my journal. What? Who are you? A Marquis, formerly of Measure 3 of the Harmonium. Formerly, I say, because I quit in El Why? Found out that Harmonium, a group I believed in from the start, was buying people, kidnapping them, making them, taking them against their will and ruining their lives. It was sucking the life out of people for daring to be different. And I couldn't take it anymore. Oh, that one guy who's in the Harmonium in the clerk ward probably wouldn't like to hear this. The Slayers will be fighting our old comrades of mine. Spits on the floor. Burks, liars. You can't trust anyone anymore. Okay. What are you doing here? Drinking. What does it look like? Been waiting for someone to come along and right the wrongs I've made. You seem like a good fellow for the job. What wrongs? Found an ammonium. Okay, same things. What's your stake? And the slavery thing, anyway. Found an ammonium. Really? Same, same line? Where are these slavers again? That's our slavers in the east inner circle. They've got to nod. Okay, so. East. To the east in the inner circle. Fine. Farewell, you some of them, bitch. To bullshit and all that. So, we already have our first mission. <sighs> Go and find some slavers. In order for part of the key. <sighs> How much of a pain in the butt is it going to be to murder these slavers? Find out next time on the Big One, please! Play Escape Torment, quested by Bormack. So that is Big Five Plus, Sayonara, and... You know, I'm wondering if I ain't got a spy following me, telling everybody my business when I come into a town. It's like, hey, 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 the guy with no name and his crew of crazy people are here. This is what they're looking for. Just give them what they want or don't, but just don't attack them because I'm already your ass, okay? Except for you guys. Try and rob them. I don't care if he's going to kill you. Try him anyway. No, I really, I really, I question things. <laughs>